Do you still have a condom in your wallet? Knock yourself out. Hi guys, welcome back to Wacko's Review, the only reviewer that has a house for you. And if you want it all, all you have to do is subscribe to this channel, share this video, and I won't lie, I will send this house to your doorsteps. So do that and roll the intro. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know how to feel about this show, and I hope this video explains what I mean. Let's start from episode 3. So Tenny went to beg that other crazy chick that has decided to leave her ex who is this rich chronic cheat and I understand that Tenny wants to clear her conscience but I also know that most people won't do this, it's like doing a lot. But to save face for that condom request she said this. Every guy has a condom in his wallet. Every guy has a condom in his wallet. Do you have a condom in your wallet? My lord, I don't want to be forward in your, in your court, may I? Wait, give me a second, let me check my wallet. <laughs> I have like 50 naira, 70. But this whole encounter ended with her being kicked out. We also find out that Chidi, who has a whooping sum of one Bitcoin, and the woman destroyer because she's constantly cheating on a lot of girls, has fallen for Tenny just after they had that funny conversation about UFC fighters. We had a deal. There's we no point. You can't even word. <laughs> if Do you don't put, I'll take this one to Computer Village. I will take it to Computer Village. Give me my phone. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait. <laughs> I go let Tiger Squad cash you. Now five months old now. Hey guys, why is the pool that color? That doesn't feel safe. But this time it's different. It's not that he wants to knack. He likes her genuinely and that's weird for him because he usually thinks after he has done something. Just like every other man in the world. Even me. On Nim's end, he's still feeling depressed and has stayed home without seeing anyone for days. And I don't blame him. It's because he has lights. If the heat that he's doing me right now was to reach his side, that depression is going to disappear. I also got a fan. I was trying to sneak this fan inside this video one way or another. Remy, who is the closest friend with names, made a big mistake in this episode. So his idea to remove his friend from depression is to pay for his gym subscription for a year. And yes, exercising helps with your mental health, but if you go there because you are depressed, you would end up looking like this. And these guys are horny, and the more muscles you get, the more sex you need. It's like yin to yang. And I'm not the one at the receiving end, it's you yes you ladies sitting there watching this video if you don't stop guys from going to the gym hey it's not my body man all isn't well in remy's household because he would get the worst news in this episode i, um, I had a fight with my mom so i'm gonna stay here for a while you can't do that first you don't want to be seen with me and now i can't even stay here if I no laugh, I go cry, so it's better I laugh, even if I have to force it. So this babe who has refused to work a day in her life and also has decided to focus solely on TikTok like the kids nowadays blew my mind in this episode with her take on working. Saying it a hundred times in a demeaning tone doesn't make it worse than contributing to a capitalist culture, okay? I will not be a part of a rat race. Nothing makes me more happier than a TikToker with a liberal take on the work system. <laughs> Let's not forget Armide. So she is seen here getting gifts from Kamal in the form of suya and bread in the morning. <laughs> that morning breath is gonna be outstanding. <sighs> But at this point, she knows she loves Kamal, and the only issue is she just wants to clear the air with Nims so she can live happily ever after with Kamal. Then episode 3 ended with Nims doing what a dog does. He tried to kiss Tenny, and she was shocked, like, what? What, what are you trying to do? <laughs> I know, guys, I should be acting in this series. <laughs> you see what I told you about Jim Bros. One day, and Baba don't turn adult star kissing anyone on sight. Episode 4 was paced the same way as the previous. Nims pushed his hat to the limit and we see an inside view on what really happens in the gym. Hey, how much are you doing now? Now soon. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, you're sexy. 
I know a lot of people were confused if these guys were friends or lovers. Even till now, I'm still confused. I don't know. So she goes on the treadmill and they mistakenly switch phones. But this should be like an hurrah moment. Imagine going to the gym for the first time on that, and maybe it's the last time of your subscription. And you and for some reason you are holding an iPhone 6. I don't know why you would even be in the gym and you own an iPhone 6, but you now switch your phone with someone that has an iPhone 12. That's it. Guys, I'm done. I think I've gotten all the exercise I need. <laughs> the way she found out the phone wasn't hers was funny. Nims got a call from Anika and this babe just the beg anyhow to the wrong person actually. Wait, so where's my phone? Maybe you swapped out someone's phone and the person is trying to call back. Yeah, 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 answer it. They call me the day me say she go hospital, say she get she get cancer of the stomach. She can't have the cash pay me for stomach. Me, you they you they mad at me? You want to wipe things with me? But now, this is what I don't understand. The weirdest thing happened. So, iPhone 6 babe yeah, returned the phone and asked Nims out. And honestly, this makes no sense to me. Why does she like him now, eh? But again, who am I to talk? <laughs> The Nigerian G. The TikToker had a twist in terms of story. We see her clean her bike, and I like that it's different. An actual episode without her dancing. Why? But after a solid seven reps of TikTok dancing with her boyfriend, he was tired. <laughs> And he tried in his tired state to tell her to go back home and probably start working. And Baba here has a rock implanted in her brain, stopping reason from happening. Then in this episode is confused on why Nimi tried to kiss her. Does he like her? Is he a predator? Is he a gym bro on steroids? Who knows? Oh, that rumor has it season three, right? Then after talking about it with her crypto boyfriend, she then asked him for condoms. And you know my guy always has a nine pack magnum locked in his wallet. So I think they went to go and do the do. And that confusing scene, I don't know why she had to sleep with him to be honest. Oh guys, I did not talk about Anuka. So Anuka just did with her man. That's all guys. <laughs> they are watching throwback videos they made with pick mix. <laughs> she, she just did guys. She's not even in this show again. <laughs> She's a main actress right? <laughs> I think the issue with the show is they have so many plots and subplots that have individual plots. I know it makes no sense. And this isn't bad, but with the duration of each episode being 23 minutes, it feels like a lot to consume. See what I mean? He has her, she has him. Main plots. He has him, he has her. Subplots. She has she, she has he, he has her. Main sub plot plots. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? It's a lot. I even forgot the most important. He has this and that. <laughs> it's confusing a little bit. I hope it gets better. And I guess it will. My expectation is this. Kamal is a scammer. He's going to take her money and bounce. The same way he did to his abroad babe. And you know what they say. Fool me once. Shame on me. Fool me twice. I was using a fake Instagram account with a girl with a big booty to take all your money. Bye. <laughs>